What's up guys, it's your boy Gaming back at it again with another video and we're doing a tutorial video. As you see we have I have four editing softwares that I can use but I'm gonna choose Windows Movie Maker. I think Windows Movie Maker is the best editing software for beginners. So let's get right into this video. So I'm gonna show you how to use all of these tools like so, so the first thing you do is go to add photos, I mean add videos and photos. Or you can go to your files and drag a video into here. And you can go like that. So you're going to go down and click on a video that you want to edit. So we do that. And if you want to add a title or a text to your video, you go over here. So add title. Sorry guys, but my R is not working, so bear with me. Make sure you like and sub. So when you do that, you can adjust it wherever you want it to go. Or, yeah, and you can add bold. I just think that makes it look better, in my opinion. And you can change the color if you want. I like to either change it to red or blue. You can change it to blue, and if you want, you could, like, make it bigger. So when you finish that, just click anywhere except that box. And then it's here. And if you want to change the way that the video comes in, like, it comes in like this. Make sure you like and sub. So, to, if you don't want it to come in like that, you can click one of these things, or you can go down if you want. I never tried the ones below it, but I, I never needed to. So you can click this, and this is how it should look. So guys, and you see the transformation from the title and the actual video. If you want to change that, like it just goes quick, like this. What's going to be? Like that. And if you want to change that, go to animations. You can click any of these or you can go down like I said we're gonna choose this one for the video just for the video and this is how it should look what's good YouTube it's your boy XXAJR Ninja here and you can also add captions to the videos so you can either put a caption in and you can put whatever you want. Mm. Leave a like if you want more more and more big videos like this. So when you do that, you can adjust it anywhere you want, like the title. So you can move it over here, and move it around like this. I want to put it over here in the corner a little bit. And add the bold, and this. Change the color so they can actually see it. So I'm going to change it to red. Make it a little bit bigger so they can see. Like I said, the R is not working on my keyboard. So you put that over there, click anywhere but that box. When you do that, it should look like this from the transformation of the video. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, XXAJR Ninja here, back in another day's video with my homie, Gaming810. Sup, guys? He's not on the thing because we don't want to move it because it's done. So that's how it should look when it's over. So now, if you want to add a webcam into your video, you can do that by clicking the webcam icon. And I'm going to do this for the video. Hi guys, I'm here. And blah, this is your boy Gaming Nate, back here again. Blah, 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 blah. Let's stop. And save it. I'm going to save it, but if you want to, you just drag it over here. Over here. So this is where you. it comes to the next section of the video. Cutting and splitting the video. So you come over here, from the home button, you click 
the edit tool. You can see the split tool, move the stick wherever you want it to go, press split, and you can move this to the split tool. And then, it should look like this. He's not on the thing because we don't want to move it because it's dying. Blah, this is your boy Game Renee, back here again, blah blah, blah blah blah, blah blah. And this is the gummy. So that's how it should look guys. And yeah, if you want to add a song to your video or an audio overlay, you could do that. So I'm just going to start with the audio overlay. Come over here, press record. So guys, it's your Game Nate, back here again, another video. Blah 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 blah. Press stop. You save it. And it should be right here. And it should come like this. This is the gummy bear of the day. So, guys, we're giving it back in again another video. Blah 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 blah. Gummy bears of life. Blah, blah, so we're gonna press browse though. So that's how it should be. And if you want to add a song to your video, you can you go to add music. Come over here. I have a couple of music saved. I'm gonna click this. Press open. And now it's just done from the video. You can move it to wherever you want. I'm just gonna move it to the actual video start. So it should come on when you see this. Make sure you like and subscribe. And this is how the whole video should look so far. Let's get it. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy XXDayJar Ninja here, back in the next video with my homie Gaming810. Sup, guys? He's not on the thing because we don't want to move it because it's done. And this is the gummy bear of the day. So that's how it should look. Any audio overlay you put over the song, it stays there. So, and then, yeah, so that's how you add a song. And if you want to add a thumbnail to your video, just go to any place where you want it to go. You can say right there, press add snapshot, and it saves to your file, then you can do whatever you want with it. You can edit the photo by going on your browser and typing in Pixlr. P-I-X-L-R. It's a great photo editing software. I really like it. So make sure you guys go check that out. So guys, if a sad moment ever happens into your video, you can either, you can go to edit split tool, the good old split tool, and you can get rid of the music from here. Right now never actually did this before you go over here go to cut go to the point in the, in the music where you want to go click on the music bar and you press split so it should split the music in half as you can see so then you move the music over here and then from the cut that you made so over here plus split and then you can go over here, go to visual effects, Inappropriate and go channel. there. And then you go over here, and you go to none. So let's see how it looks from the start. Guys, I know this is too inappropriate for my channel, but just because I can. So that's how it should look. It should be all gray and stuff like that. And you can move it over here. And this is how the transformation goes. The Poco Man. See? Alright, guys. And I forgot to mention you can go over here to Project. Project. Go to Audio Mix. When you go to Audio Mix, you can adjust how loud they want to hear the music and how loud you can. they want you to hear you. So you can adjust it to about right there so they can hear you a little bit better and this is how it should sound. Ross, well, check this one out. We say impossible. As you have noticed, or after you had should have noticed, you can hear that the music got a little bit lower and you can hear the video more. So I showed you how to put a video in there, do all of these things, add music, 
all this. You can also add credit for the end of the video. We did the animations, we did all this stuff, we did the visual effects, we go to project. Um, I don't recommend using these stuff, so just leave that on. You go to view, you can zoom in, timeline, and stuff like that. You can go to thumbnail size and stuff like that. So, yeah. You can go to the edit tool, and this is where it gets interesting. If you go check out XXHR's home for what I'm about to do. So you go to the, oh sorry, go to the nice old trusty edit tool, and press split. When you press split, go to a place where you want this to stop. So I'm gonna, I want it to stop right about there. Go here, press the split tool again. When you go there, if you want to stop the music, you can, but I, uh, I don't recommend anything. It's your choice. You can stop the music if you want to. So then, go to edit again, and you go to the start of where you cut it at, right here, and then go to edit, and you could do the speed. I'm going to make it right here, like that, and it should stop right there. I'm going to do that. Go to the end of the clip, you go back to edit, and you put it back, and it should be back to normal. So let's watch it from there. This is like... So it should do that, and it's funny. And if you want to do a time lapse, you could do the exact same thing, but put the the speed of the thing of the timeline faster. If you want to do a time lapse, and that should do that should be about everything. You can also go over here. Wait, I forgot where it was. No, I forgot where it was. You can also go over here and press rotate. The video you can rotate it wherever you want it to be so when you do that that's everything you need to know guys basically everything and you go to when you're finished with everything go to save and you save it to your documents or you can upload it straight to youtube using the youtube application share and that's basically everything music tool oh you can do that oh yeah i forgot to Suggest fade in fast and fade in fast. I mean, fade out fast. I mean, opposite, guys. I know I'm messing up a lot in this tutorial. Fade in slow, fade out slow. Alright, guys. So that's everything you need to know about Movie Maker. And you should be able to edit and all that stuff in there. Make sure you leave a What's good, YouTube? It's your boy. Oh, I didn't even. Make sure you leave a like on this video if you want to see another tutorial video coming from my channel. I hope you guys have a nice rest of your day. Peace.